Ken Hockey, Senior Editor with Workboat Magazine, and I've got three questions for Jerry Goche, Vice President, General Manager of the Americas Region for Oceaneering International in Morgan City, Louisiana. Jerry, you just took delivery of the 200 foot by 46 foot ocean project, a four point dive vessel. Can you explain to us what that means? Yes. A four point dive vessel is a vessel built much in the, the ship shape of a uh, offshore field supply vessel that runs uh, equipment and supplies to drilling operations typically. One of these vessels is outfitted with anchor winches, anchor wires and anchors, and of course it is self-propelled and self-maneuverable so it can go out and set its own four-point mooring spread without assistance from a tugboat and that's where the a lot of cost saving, cost savings are realized and when work is done and it's ready to leave it can recover all of its anchors without tug assist and then go on its way. So it saves the customers a lot of money as it can moor and unmoor on its own. Given that, uh, what does the book offer the industry that others don't? The, uh, the new ocean project, is, it's the first purpose-built vessel that was made from the keel up just for diving services. Historically, we've always, uh, our company and all of our competitors have taken uh, usually use pretty wore out uh, offshore supply vessels, converted them into dive boats, which means putting all the equipment on deck and it's in the midst of all the winches and the anchor wires and whatnot and use and declare that a four point dive vessel. Again, we've done it as well. This boat is unique in that all of the equipment, everything the divers will use to, for life support, for their hydraulic systems, their jetting systems, all built below deck, all the gases are below deck. So the entire deck of the vessel is free for to to perform the work at hand. It's never been done before. You know, we said let's try to make one that's purpose built for diving, and we've done that. What do you see ahead for the offshore industry over the next say twelve to eighteen months? Twelve to eighteen months. So much of that depends on the, the situation in Washington D.C., the administration, the regulatory agencies. If they'll leave the industry alone and let us drill uh, the way it can be safely done, it's been proven and it works, then it would be a bright future. There's a lot of oil out there to be had. It can be done safely. I've been in this industry 42 years and uh, the Macondo was a one-off thing and I think if they would just back off and leave us alone we can uh, make this country a lot more energy independent. All right, Jerry. Thanks for your time. Thank you.